Hi babies, it's Sim Baby here or Jay. And today I bring you a new LP. I am sorry for kind of the lack of content. I've been trying to fix my game. I'm trying to make sure everything is running smoothly. And that's been going good for now. Everything's been going okay. So you guys, we are starting a new challenge called the Making It Out Challenge by Astro Nee Sims. Now, this challenge, here are the rules. You have to have a main character. It has to be a teen, which is who our beautiful Sim right here is. She is a teenage Sim. She has to be from a poor area situation. I do have to live in Copperdale, like this really small lot. I'll give you backstory on the family in a second. No money cheats. So, yeah, we're going to be struggling a little bit. Have less than $2,000 in the bank started off. We only have 1K. Our main goal is to get accepted into college after high school graduation. That is our main goal. Now, I don't know how this is going to go with what our sim is going to be doing throughout the um, LP. I haven't played with teens at all since, you know, high school years or anything. I haven't played with teens, like, at all. Like, I don't really know what to do with teens. Next is to go to college and get your sims degree and become rich and successful. Complete the fabulously wealthy challenge with a milestone and you navigate through your sims life, love life, and social life, all while still trying to make it out. Have fun and get creative. So my thing is, my goal is once this sim has like a significant other and starts her family and lives in the most gorgeous house or apartment or anything at the end of this elf, well, it's a challenge, at the end of this challenge, that's how I know we're finished. So I don't know how long this challenge is going to be. I feel like it's going to be fun. So to start off with a team sale, so it's gonna be pretty long. Um, but yeah. So this is I think I forgot her name. <laughs> so this is I think it's London. Is it London? <laughs> no, this is Lauren. London's her little sister. So this is Lauren Nichols. She is a teen sim. And let me get a little backstory. So, Lauren and London, their mom didn't look how. Their mom is a very sad case. I don't have no trigger warnings for anybody, but there is a trigger warning. Um, Their mom suffered with drug abuse. Um, She is no longer here. She died of an OD. So, RIP to Miss Nichols, their mother. But the girls are living with their grandmother. I can say that. So they do have someone to watch over them. But Lauren and London, they don't particularly get along with their grandmother. She's very mean. She's very strict. She's she's very distant from the girls. I guess because of how her daughter turned out. The girls are just, as you can see, she has mommy issues. Her grandma judges her a lot. And I, I can understand being through that myself during my teen years and my child years. So Lauren is 16, 17 years old. She's almost done in high school, but she, you know, they've been living with their grandmother since she was in middle school. It's been, it's been heavy for them. Um, as you can see, our girl is tense. And I'm gonna say is, Miss Mama's right here, their grandmother, Miss Joy. Miss Joy is a mean ass lady, yo. Like she, I don't even know. Like she's very like, she picks on the girls. She makes fun of them. She's addicted to us, you know, her cigarettes and everything. But yeah, this is her. This is Miss Joy Nichols. I do not, you know, I have fun making her. That's all I can say. I do have to copy and paste the rest of her outfits because I don't know what to do with elders, the outfits. Um, and this is London. I have to fix her name and cast, but I will do that later. I don't feel like doing it right now. London is a cute little thing. Like, she, ooh, girl. Sim, get together. Get it together. Fix your life. Uh, so this is Lauren. No, London. <laughs> Sorry, y'all. This is London. She is really like, she does not like the way her grandma treats her older sister. She does stick up for her older sister because, you know, your little siblings got your back no matter what. Yeah, but the girls share a room. I'm going to give you a tour of the house. You saw some of it already. I'm going to give you guys a tour of the house. Let me turn around. So this is the home. This is where Miss Joy lives. Oh. 
Not me forgetting. Now Nana Joy, she she got her money. She re, she, you know, lives off her nothing actually. She doesn't have a job. I will get back to that as well. So you go in here, you walk in, there is this big, nice, open living room, dining room and kitchen. Yes, it has, you know, Max's stuff. I said this is a grandma home. I'm not going to really deck out a home like that, especially when it comes to a grandma's house. Like, The Sims game makes grandma houses look cozy, so I just kept it the way it was. I got off the gallery. So this is grandma's room. She's, it's, it's just like plain, simple, you know, very much, you know, grandma. Um, and then the bathroom is right here, I believe. It's a big bathroom. Look, y'all, y'all about to see something for real. This is such a grandma house that there's only a tub. She don't believe in showers. She's scared for, you know. People are going to slip and fall. So we don't have a shower or anything. Who made grilled cheese and put it in the bathroom? It looked good though. It looked good. And then you come through here. And turn back around. Oh, it's grandma and her friends. Hmm. And then you go through here. The girls room is still very much kitty. Grandma just said, I'm going to do whatever the fuck I want and put some random shit in here. But along the way, I want to add, like, you know, Lauren redoing the room for her and her sister to make it look better with through her, you know, part-time job. So with Lauren, she is a very busy teenager. Y'all might say, well, if Grandma doesn't have, like, you know, a job, how do they survive? They survive off of Lauren's checks. From her fast food job. I'm saying she works. So I'm gonna say she works at McDonald's. Okay, so they only live off her check. As you can see, she only works four hours a day, making seventeen dollars an hour. That is barely anything. Barely anything. And plus, she also has her school stuff. I did not put an after school program because I know it's going, you know, collide with the job. But yeah. This is my girl, Lauren. She is so cute. Wait, look at the braces. They're pink. She has pink braces. Ooh, pink braces. No, insurance can cover that because they got grandma's insurance, but hell. You can tell this is a grandma's apartment. You see all the gnomes and all the plants everywhere. The garden. Yeah. And it's the fall time, so the semester has started for them. She goes back to school tomorrow. Her first day of junior year in high school. She is mad, child. I see why she's mad. So she is very tense. She says, too much on my plate from feeling like you're going to snap on someone. I don't know why I continue to walk around her here babysitting everyone else's feelings when no one gives a fark about mine. How much do these things expect me to put up with before I completely use my lose my shit? But she does like her own personal space. I can't say from the time being bullied by her, um... Grandmother, she does have, like, you know, she likes being by herself, so she does like... I mean, she enjoys her sister's company, of course, but, yeah. I mean, it's fun. I like it. I only played it for, like, a day. So, when I'm home, I can finally take off the mask. I don't have to worry about what everyone else thinks of me. I can just unapologetically be my authentic self. I love Lauren. Like, I'm starting to love her. So upset. So, she still feels hurt by her grandma. Her grandma their grandmother is mean, y'all. She is mean. Like, when I say that, she is mean, she is mean. And I don't have her go pee, so she has to pee. But yeah, this household, it has been fun for the day I did play it. Um, why can't she get to the bathroom? Is someone else using it? Oh, she's using it. So go ahead and go here. Uh, so we're gonna have, does she work today? No, she doesn't work till Wednesday. So it's really just like, you know, very chill, very like, you know, good things. I want her to do more things to make more money, but I just don't know what to do with her. 
Girl, you're using the money when there's food in the fridge. Your grandma cooked yesterday. Look, do you want to get cussed out? Oh, there is no food. All right, so I'm going to have you cook then. Please don't burn this house down. I beg of you. Please don't burn this house down. So I'm going to have her try and attempt to make something. I don't know what she can really make. Um, yeah, she has no cooking skill. So we're just going to talk to her. I don't know. She's coming in. So we have Grandma make some food. I forgot to get Granny's cookbook, but it's okay. Um, what's this? Um, oh, it's still lunch time, so we can serve some lunch. Hello, all right, so we can serve some. Um, no, not that. See, she don't be mean already. Look, make an enemy. Lady, your deathbed is calling. You want to be that? Clock oven chicken. Did I say that right? And, you know, grandma going to use the money. That's what she usually does. She likes to take the money that, you know, Lauren makes. And I've been trying to get Lauren to make her own account, but, you know, she still feels like she owes her grandma for taking them in. And I feel like she's going to realize one day she's going to have to do her own shit. Why are you prepping in here? Prep out here. You have a whole counter space. Do I gotta delete something for you? I'll delete this coffee. Because it's not like you can't cook. Oh, the spaces are small. Can you cook on here? Oh, not you. Do that. I should have play tested. it. Oh, you can't look at, use that space? Damn, I wish I would have known. Uh, I thought I gotta change it now. I'm gonna change it. There you go. Thank you. All right, so grandma is cooking the cook oven, whatever chicken thing. It, ooh, look at the mushrooms. <laughs> what is she doing? Oh, she's helping grandma cook. Oh, they're all. Look at them. So they try to be nice to her. She's nice sometimes, but you know, it's she has her on and off days. Joy, you should know how to cook. I guess not. She said I got these little ass rascals in my house. Who the fuck? No. <laughs> oh, she still feels hurt. Look at her, she's helping her cook. I mean, she's not as mean to London as she is to Lauren. I don't know why. Don't ask me why. It's just how she is. When her eyes are bothering her, maybe something's just in her eye. Okay, maybe something more serious. I'm playing with the autonomy. It's not a good idea. Oh, not both of them. Her eyes bothering them. Somehow, Grandma make... Ooh, that TV is loud, child. I'm gonna turn that down. Oh, this is nice. Okay, so I have to to make an appointment with the optometrist for the girls. Nice, right, she's not scheduled when she's done cooking. So you see as the girls are helping her cook, it's been kind of peaceful, kind of chill. But why y'all gotta turn shit all the way up? Like I, go later. And girl, 
Girl. You can't. She made food for the girls. Oh, that was good. Uh, I might want some that. I think I made that the other day, but it wasn't, you know, that. Oh, is this bad quality? Oh, no. Wash your hands. Why you ain't say your hands are dirty? Oh. I said it to normal. Because I can't. I can't. <laughs> oh, y'all have to wash your hands before you eat? That is cool. Joy is struggling like my girl right here is struggling. Oh, they're eating at the table together? What? Alright. So she's gonna be like, okay. Move the fucking thing. Let's get down so. Get down so. She's gonna be like, so Lauren, you ready for your first day of junior year tomorrow? You know, you start, you can't, wait, I gotta make a grandma voice. <coughs> Joy. No. <laughs> Lauren, you ready for your first day of, you know, 11th grade tomorrow? You getting up there, honey? You about to graduate soon. She's like, I know, Grandma. It's just, I don't have any friends. No one really talks to me. No one really interacts with me. You know, it's been hard. She's like, nah, baby, you're going to have to talk to people. You don't talk to people. That's your own fault. And if they don't like you, maybe there's a reason they don't like you. Learn thing like, bitch, <laughs> did she just say that? My own grandma. <laughs> and London is just like, why is this lady always so me? Like, look at her face. She's like, this chicken good and all, but my grandma always made to my big sissy. I don't understand it. Sometimes I feel like Lauren should just drop kick her ass. I'm kidding, y'all. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. That's just me, though. But she's like, yeah, grandma, I have to, you know, we have, I wanted to, you know, tell you that with my new job and everything, I'm not going to be home like that. So taking care of London is going to be mainly, like, your priority. She said, nah, baby, I can't do that. I got, like... I gotta go to bingo with my friends. I gotta go out. I gotta, you know, grandma got some dates and everything. I can't be staying home with Lauren all the time. Well, with London all the time. So you expect London to stay at the house by herself without you? Something can happen to her. She said, I'll cook before she, you know, before I leave for my stuff, you know? Give grandma a chance, baby. Just let me do what I gotta do. London be okay by herself some days. I mean, you don't work every day, do you? She's like, no, no, I don't. But at the same time, I don't want my little sister here by herself. You know what could happen? She be all right. She be all right. Just let grandma do what she got to do. You know, I've been in this world longer than you have. I know more than you. So please, just shut up about it. And it's like, just eat your food. Just eat your food, baby. Just eat your food. Lord, it's bringing back memories. <laughs> Okay, so I'm just having to finish eating. It looked like they eat some good ass food. I ain't gonna lie. Me, I'll eat this. With the garlic bread, mashed potatoes, and the chicken stew. Oh, that sounds so good right now. I should make that the next day. <laughs> well, they're fine for now. Damn, London. Oh, something happened? Child's play. She's fine. Oh my god, what happened? What happened? Who's in my corner? From being in your feelings, whenever I'm down and out, I can never count on anyone else to be there for me. I've been I've been my own support system for so long that I don't feel like I have family, friends, anyone. What in the fuck is someone gonna show up for me? I and show me that the nurturing I deserve. Oh baby. Oh babe. <laughs> oh Lordy. So we are going to be joining no wait what no offense from unintentional consequences of neuro neurodiverse condition oh fuck lauren just feels like no one understands what she's going through and how it affects her she really doesn't mean to offend doesn't mean to offend or upset anyone sometimes her issues just gets the better of her 
How are you feeling sad offending anyone? I mean, let's talk to her about it. So she can, like, you know, um, complain about my problems. And then, uh, divergent. Ask to see, damn. And then ask her for advice. I mean, she probably can't give you any honey. So I'm like, Grandma, I need to talk to you about something. Before we go, oh, child. She's like, before I go in tomorrow morning, I do want to tell you that, like, I've been feeling some type of way about myself. And I have been feeling, like, down and depressed about certain things. And it just makes me feel like I don't, you know, really know how to process everything right now. And she's like, baby, what do you mean you're depressed? What is depressed? I mean, you a teenager. You got your life to live. You don't know what being depressed is. You're just young. You don't know anything about that. So stop making up stories and just, you know, live your teenage life. Go have fun. And uh, Lauren is just like, but you don't understand. Crying and not barely eating and, you know, not having a teen life for anything. And barely any friends. It's affecting me, Grandma. And I want you to understand. Hey, Rosha, and Grandma just like, mm-hmm. Oh, did you even give her advice? Or are you just ignoring her? No, she still feels the same. My baby, uh... Don't laugh on her face, ho. The fuck? You lucky you owe. Oh, was... Mm. Mm. Oh. Oh! It's so much. Whoa. We didn't start that yet. So. Why well, don't Fled doing work right now, Sebastian? It's the start of the semester, so. We'll see. We'll see. And it's just like... I don't know how... To actually feel about it between the two of them but I am gonna girls this whole sink in the fucking kitchen I am gonna have you know that's not your bed I am gonna have her come in here this is your bed and cry it out because she is sad oh grandma's sad now but she's never gonna let nobody know that so the baby, I'll be back. I gotta go in my room. She's like, okay. Grandma crying, Lauren crying. London here just chilling, watching her kids' TV. Um, you loud. Very. Can I? Can I? Oh, my baby's crying. All right. So I am going to have. Oh, she's taking pictures. Well, that kind of helped, I guess. <laughs> she still feels that same way, though. Oh. Awkward. They're so cute. Now, who the hell is playing a violin? Grandma. Oh. Oh, my ears. I see you trying, though. Ooh. Uh, let me see if Lauren might like this. I'm going to have her paint a painting and see if she likes it. And do a small one for 50. Go ahead, girl. We got, you know, $681 to, like, you know, keep. Oh, she oh it's cold outside. The country is so nice. I love it. She's so cute. Oh, Lauren got some artwork on her. Hold on. I see you, Stink. I see you. 
Grandma is not that violin is Ciao. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. So I'm gonna have, you know, Lundy come here and take her bath for the night. What is this? Oh, I'm gonna put that in the fridge then. Since it's already there. So we're gonna go over here. I'm gonna have her take her bath before she goes to bed and have her brush her teeth. Take your bath, brush your teethers. It's 9.30, so you gotta go to bed, honey. Why does she have a shirt on when she's naked? I'm confused. Oh, Lauren, that is nice. That looks real nice. Oh my gosh, it looks something my sister would draw. I really like that. I'm gonna have her put it in her inventory. Ooh, what's more? What's wrong? Unclean hands and waste of time from being an overseer. What kind of work is this? Why even make anything if this is the outcome? Lauren, it's a good painting. My God. Oh, yeah. Grandma, can you stop with that and come over here and set the, you know, curfew and stuff? So I'm going to set a curfew. Grandma's like, my curfew is seven, honey. And... And write notes for Lauren in the morning. Oh, she gets along with London. Okay, she just don't get along with Lauren. Girl, you stuck behind the violin. What the hell? Girl, come here. I said to teleport. Jesus. Is. Put it in your inventory. My God. <laughs> All right. So, go ahead and set the curfew for seven. Who is talking? What are you doing? You said curfew. What are you doing? Oh, she's practicing her debate. Mm. Oh, girl! Come out here. Come watch this. Grandma got the discipline, you honey. She's like, Grandbaby, what the hell are you doing out here jumping in that damn trash? She said, I'm sorry, Grandma, I just wanted to play. She said, Your ass should be in that damn bed. <laughs> <laughs> She said, you're actually being a damn bit. I don't know why you were out here playing in this shit. And you just took your bath. And what was the other thing? Oh, yeah. You know better. You know better. Stop doing this crap. Please. Please. Where you get in trouble? She's like, okay, Grandma. Okay. She's like, I don't want you to turn on like your sister now. I did do that so she can do like the parenting stuff. Yeah, so. That's why I did it. I'm gonna do her like that too. Cause you know her grandma their grandma are there is their defendant. Well I guess this is for her. It's like Oh, I'm her. Oh wait, is it a high school thing? I know that. So I'm gonna have her set up her little, you know, social bunny account. Welcome to Social Bunny, a place to connect, yada yada yada. To get so I use the button to add friends. We don't have friends yet. Damn. So I'll go ahead and go to sleep. Oh, you have to get ready for bed. I just thought about that. Hold on. <laughs> you, yes, yeah, sleep. You, what is this? No, that's not your bed. This is your bed. This is your bed. This is your bed. Go to sleep. So I'm gonna have you come here and finish and take your bath. You brush your teeth. It's time for y'all to go to bed. Oh, y'all. Okay, I'm gonna put these as all lights, all lights. Okay. So London is going to sleep in her Barbie bed. Too cute. Grandma is sleep in her bed. 
And then, now I'm going to go ahead and speed it up so when she goes to bed. Alright, so you guys are going to end this very first episode here. Tell me what you think about their story. Tell me what you think about their life and how you think. Tell me how you think Lauren should handle things when it comes to her grandmother. And now, first up, ooh. <laughs> Jada. The next episode is going to be her first day of high school. And I cannot wait to get that out. I might get it out by tomorrow. Or the day after tomorrow. Because this could be out tomorrow. Like, I'm ready for the OP. I'm ready. So, again, I want to thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. And turn on that post notification button. And again, thank you guys for watching. Um, I love you guys. And bye, babies.